Okay, so I wanted to take a second to show you how this uh, irrigation, solar irrigation system works. I don't have plants up yet, but I wanted to show you how this thing works so you can quickly go through and set it up. And the nice thing about this is it's super customizable. They give you a ton of hose that you can go through and use, and they give you a ton of the drippers as well, as you can see here. I just have two set up to show you kind of how it works. So first you, of course, have the solar panel, which gives it all of the power here. This does, it does come with a couple of screws and wall anchors if you wanted to go through and mount this, but I imagine most people will probably just stick it in the ground similar to this. You can go through and move this to wherever you would like, and you can see it has a very, very long extension cord. So you can have this further away while you are going through and um, uh, you know, closer to the sun wherever you need that to be. You can see here, I have a place where it's kind of shaded and then it comes out, more of the sun comes over here. So I'll probably plant it, maybe put the solar thing over there. And then here's the actual device. We'll come back to this in a minute, but you can see you just really go through and hook the solar up here. And then there is the, uh, the, the, the level, I guess is what they call this here. And these are just two little sensors that you put inside of the water. And the purpose of these is to um, keep track of the water level. So if these sensors detect that there is no more water, it will automatically turn off. This hose right here is your in hose. So you can see this little thing, you just go through and attach it right here um, and put that in the water. That is what actually gives the, or lets the water flow through the machine. Um, and then here you can see you just go through and put that on the in and then you get this and you have the out. So it gives you one hose and then you just use scissors to go through and cut those uh, to whatever setting you want. And then from there you can go through and you can see they give you these little uh, splitters here. When you cut it, you use these to um, attach the hose to different spots. And now how the machine actually works, you can see right now it is off, um, but if I wanted to go through and turn that on and it will start working, but before I turn it on, I wanna show you, you can go through and set the clock on here so it's the, the right time. You can have a start time, uh, the exact time that you want it to start. You can go through and move these to um, tell you uh, to set the exact start time on here. And then over here, you can set how long you actually want this thing to run, and then also how often. So you can set the amount of intervals or hours that you want it to run, and then there's the other. And then finally, when you want it to just go through and run, you can hit the on here. You can see it's incredibly quiet, and it just goes through, gets the water, and then you have the little drip system there. So this thing is incredibly useful. Um, excited to go through and actually get some plants in here. And you can see as long as you have access to the sun, this thing is gonna work on its own. You just need a bucket of water or something you can go through and fill up. I would recommend like a five gallon bucket similar to this. Uh, that way you don't have to fill it up very often. But uh, yeah, this is a great little solution for watering plants.